Hey everyone, this is Julia from Crocoblock, and as you can see from the title, today's video will be a form validation overview, so we will take a closer look at the capture settings. If you are new to our channel, please make sure you are subscribed and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Besides, if you want us to make more useful tutorials for you, like this video and leave your comments down below. And now, let's get started! So, a WordPress form capture is a method of a verification via a picture. Basically, capture looks either like a picture with symbols and the user should recognize them and type into the bar. Or it can be a set of pictures and the user will need to pick out similar objects. There are also audio-based captures and question-based captures, but the most common ones are the first two types. So, once the feature is activated, the website can understand that the user is not a robot, but a human. To adjust the global capture settings, go to WordPress dashboard, JetForm Builder, Settings. Here in the Capture Settings tab, you will see four verification options. Let's start with the first one. Once you unfold a recapture, Three fields will be available for customization. The site key and the secret key can be registered on the Google Recapture website. As for the score threshold, it is set to 0.5 value by default. This field allows setting a value between 0 to 1. The less the value set, the more likely the system will recognize a user who tries to pass a recapture as a bot. For instance, the 0.3 option will make the process of solving the capture harder, while 0.7 makes it much easier. Once adjusted, settings should be saved by pressing the corresponding button. The next one is age capture. The age capture contains only the site key and the secret key fields, which can be obtained on the corresponding website. Friendly capture. The site key and the secret key of the friendly capture can be generated on this website. The turnstile section also allows setting the global site key and the secret key. If needed, they can be found on the Cloudflare Turnstile website. The great thing about the JetForm Builder plugin is that the capture settings can also be adjusted directly in the newly added form during the customization. The new form can be added through the WordPress dashboard, JetForm Builder, Add New, or simply edit the form you already have. I will open, let's say, this first form just as an example. And by the way, if you want to build and set up the reset password form on your website, we have a really nice detailed tutorial, so go ahead and check it out. At the JetForm tab of the form settings contains the needed capture settings section. Initially, the capture provider here is set to the without protection option, which means that the current form isn't secured by capture. By unfolding the drop-down list, the options I mentioned earlier can be selected. If the recapture option is picked, the same settings can be adjusted. The site key, secret key, and the score threshold. Or there is also the Use Global Settings toggle available which pulls data from the dashboard settings, so there is no need to complete them again. With the H Capture provider, the global settings can also be used by enabling the mentioned toggle, or the site key and the secret key can be completed manually. 
Also, keep in mind that every provider has its block, which can be put in the form. By default, the captcha is placed before the submit button, but the corresponding block can be added to define another place for the captcha. The mentioned block can be added by pressing the button in the capture settings. Or the general blocks search. Above the block, there are icons that can change the block into another capture provider's block. Once you select, for example, recapture, the capture provider automatically changes to the according option. Also, the block can be dragged and put in the desired place of the form. Now, the following turnstile provider has the same settings as a previously mentioned H capture. The Use Global Settings switcher to pull the global settings, the site key, and the secret key fields for manual completion of the needed data. And of course, the Add Turnstile Block button for a quick appearance of the block on the page. The Friendly Capture option also covers the mentioned settings. Among them are the Use Global Settings, the Site Key and Secret Key, and Add Friendly Capture Block button. All Jetform Builder forms support these awesome captures. And if you want to know how to set up form validation on your website, stay tuned, make sure you are subscribed, and please check if you have the notifications turned on. This will be the safest way not to miss our videos. Smash that like button if you enjoyed this overview. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.